Okay, so to make your YouTube banner, the first thing you want to do is Google YouTube banner size template. So I picked any old one, so it really doesn't matter. And you want to crop that down to its original size. After that, you want to go and Google again a background. I put aesthetic background and then just look. I do look on Google. You can do Pinterest, Tumblr, whatever. You get a background and then crop that down and save it to your phone as well. So then you want to go to this app, Fonto. And when you open it up, it's going to look like this. You want to go to plain images and then put in the measurements, custom. And these are the measurements right here that you need to put in. So you want to press at the bottom the use. Don't save it yet, but use. And then bring up your background from Google. This is a tilt, so you can turn it slightly size, width, and movement of the image and you just want to fit it to it you can but i just widen it out it's going to crop when you save it so just get what you want in that little bar if you can so next you want to go to magic eraser it's going to have like two ad pop up and you want to go to if you want a picture you want to go to your images pick what picture you want and then it's a lot of different options you can do a look good at a time a lot of the time or you could just expand your eraser and erase. So, yeah, that's the I kept this in this stuff is fun to me. Right here, I just wanted to show like if you did mess up or something, or if you went like over, I think obviously it's a restore, it's at the bottom. Yeah, that's it. So yeah, I'm getting almost done, but as you can see, it's like little bitty particles. If you want to see that better, you just invert, which is like the little circle. It's like black and white. You invert it and then you make sure that everything is where you want to go. But this time you switch it to restore, which is mean the opposite of what it means. You can understand when you do it, but that's that again. So then you want to go and save it. I save it in high quality and make sure it's PNG. So go back to Fonto, then go into camera roll like photo album and pick the photo that you just saved of your last template so once you do that i added text to mine just by tapping these are all the fonts they have already but i added my own font just for this one in particular and i put my channel name on there with some little sparkles just because and i made it aligned to the center it really didn't make a difference but that's that you can move it around with your finger if you want. There's a move button. I didn't show it here, but for at the beginning I did all. Well, I don't think I showed it here. I did. So this is how you will move it with what they give you. So you want to go back and then get those PNGs of the erase photos that you did. They'll be really tiny, but it's smaller here. Looks bigger on this actual device. It looks really small here, but it's bigger when you see it. So I just move this around with the same arrows and added all of my pictures to that so i'll just let you watch that
take a screenshot and crop it down just like you did the other videos. So go back into Magic Eraser, open it up from your camera roll, and then with this one, I used Tolerance and just got rid of all the green, which I love. And then I mainly erased the hand because I didn't want it to. And then save it as PNG, high resolution again. So you bring it back up, open it up, just like you did the three photos, and then put it to wherever you want it to go. Using the same size movements and everything else. So when you're completely done, you want to go to the bottom, to the little save, and then save image as PNG. This should pop up, press OK, and then go back to plain images. But this time, pick one with color or something that will go with your background and change it to these templates. This is just TV and computer, but those really are on its own. So you go back to your camera roll, bring out the banner that you just saved, and try to center it as much as you can. It doesn't have to be perfect because when you put it to YouTube, it'll give you an option to crop it. But that's it. Mm -hmm.